Hey everybody, Ken Surfs here. Welcome back to the Shaved Den. It's the weekend, July the 4th weekend, and uh, we're gonna do a shave for you today. I get to use a cool new single edge razor today. Uh, the Asylum Injector Razor that's from Bull Goose Shaving. And it's actually, uh, they're located here in Redondo Beach, California, Southern California. And I have been doing a lot of shaves with like single edge, like, uh, you know, I've got the leaf, uh, the, the thorn or the twig, and uh, I've been at supply, I've used one, and I've been using a few single edge lately. And a lot of people have been asking me, what do I think of the Asylum Injector Razor? And I'm gonna be honest, I've never tried it. So today, for the first time, I'm gonna be trying out from Asylum Shave Works, released through Bull Goose Shaving. The Asylum Injector Razor. Look at that head. Now, first thing I noticed is uh, when it says in injector razor, I was looking for the port. Usually you have the uh, injector, you push the port in, you slide the blade in. This has a completely different mechanism and I find it pretty intriguing. So we're gonna be looking at this razor in a few minutes and I'll show you all the cool features of it. And we're gonna be using this today. Now, just in time for the 4th of July, PAA has Tea Party 508. Now, this scent uh, is, is highly scented with different teas, but this scent was originally introduced uh, back in 2015 for the second annual New England Wet Shavers Meetup in Boston, and it was very popular. And here's all the tea scents that uh, are in this one. Top notes, green tea, white tea, lemon, bergamot, salt water, middle notes, spicy, sweet, floral, earl gray, base notes, black tea, vanilla, musk, amber, and tobacco. And I'm gonna be using this soap and aftershave for the first time today too. So I got three new items that I'm gonna be using today. Now I'm, I've used the uh, Pearl, hey, it's 4th of July weekend, right? I've used the Pearl synthetic before, but I'm gonna be using it again. And I'm gonna be putting it in here, getting ready for this shave. Oh, and I'm also gonna be using Schick, what is it, the B20 Proline Blades, injector blades. Now, now, first of all, this razor is stainless steel and it has some curves on it, like a Porsche race car. Look at this. Look at that, knurling. You can grip this very well. It's got the Asylum Shave logo on the bottom and it's a three piece, watch this. You load the blade manually. You can lower the head. First of all, I'm just take the head off. This has been out for a while. Okay. Here's the head. Blade locks up right there. This kind of cool mechanism here, the guide. Holds everything in place. So this drops so you can put the blade in and it locks it up really nice. So I'm gonna leave that drop just like that. Again, you do not just inject this razor into the razor, you actually manually put it in. So I'm gonna take that blade out. See, it's quite easy to do. Just don't wanna cut yourself. Place the blade right there. You just set the blade right on there. They've got the two notches that hold it in place. Tighten up. Perfect. Locks this down tight. There's no slack, no looseness. Sometimes with an injector, maybe it's not in right, it's not seated right. This is locked in perfect. So this is ready to go. And it just looks, like I said, it's got the curves of a sports car on there. Very, very nice razor. I watched some other people's uh, videos on this razor and they're saying for the price and it's 120 bucks. Once in a lifetime razor, it's really all you need. They were saying, oh, I don't like the packaging. I, packaging, 
I saved the packaging. I'm anal. I always save the boxes, but boxes well put together. Might not be as fancy as you want, but uh, hey, for me, packaging is not an issue. All right. Like I said, this is going to be a real nice shave. I like shiny things. <laughs> and it's polished. It is a really nice razor. All right. Shall we get the shave started? Wet the face a little bit. Tea Party 508. I did not go to the tea party or the uh, reunion or the meetup in 2015 in the East Coast in Boston, but it sounds like it was fun. Did you guys go? Did you try that this scent then? Man. The soap, yep. Man, it's thirsty. Look how thick this is. Oh, man. Almost too thick. Didn't have enough Look at that. Didn't have enough water on my brush. Well, I guess if you were talking about soap, you probably want it too thick and not thick enough. CK6, very slick. Very slick. Man, that brush is not holding a lot of water. My hands are slippery, but this looks like it's holding good. All right, let's try this out for the first time. Very nice. Very nice. I feel it just taking the whiskers right off. Not in an aggressive way, but in a smooth way. Could be the soap helping too, right? You can get under your nose really well. Handles all the curves and the wrinkles of my chin. It's not clogging. Now I do have a blister here or a healing cut there. I hope I don't open up that wound. Oh, there it is there. I'm going to avoid that. Hugs the contour of your face. A lot of tea scent in here. My mom would have loved it. My mom was a tea drinker like crazy. I'm from England. I do not drink tea. I drink coffee. Don't hold it against me. Damn, that is the thickest soap. And that was me putting that on, that thick. Oh, man. I really like the feel of this. this on a little thinner now. There we go. You might not think there's a too thick claws with soap, but I do. But man, be 
BPA slick soap wants to go on thick. I can tell this is a, a very close shave because I can feel my skin tingling, which means that this thing went and cut that whiskers really short. Doesn't feel too much on the mild side. This feels like it's leaning a little bit. Oh, got me a little bit. Tad on the aggressive, hence. Super smooth shave. Kind of like little bell on the L end, so you don't drop it too. This soap is thick. Okay, got me a little bit right there. All right, I can handle that. Those blades might be pretty aggressive too. I'm not familiar with the B20 Shicks. Are they mild? Are they aggressive? What's your opinion? I've done the Captain Kai pinks. I know how they feel. They're pretty sharp. And uh, Bull Goose shaving. You can get all the injector blades there. You can get all different razors, sand, soaps, everything too. So, and Phoenix Artisan, if you watch the channel, you know I love their soaps. In fact, I've got another set of soaps that I gotta try out. One tiny nick. I'm ready to rock for the 4th of July, guys. All right, now comes the fun part. Brand new. No fingernails. <laughs> there we go. All right. <laughs> that razor cuts close, guys. What a burn. Whoo! That about lifted me up out of my feet, out of my shoes. What a close shave razor. Phenomenal combination today. The blade, the razor, the soap. Phenomenal. All right. <laughs> I was wondering, but like I said, I've heard great things about the razor and I know great things about PA soaps. So, all right, everybody. Well, thank you so much for watching. Happy 4th of July. I'm probably going to do another video soon. And until then, stay safe. Bye for now.